Oh damn, look at this place. Again, it's better days, but beautiful. I love libraries like this. Moby Dick, <laughs> Melville's classic. The epic battle between man and whale. Mandatory reading for any whaler, I guess. <laughs> True. This piano is in disrepair. Looks like the Hawkins kept it more for decoration. I mean, everything is in disrepair. How can you tell? Nice. Nice lighting. Damn, she drew a lot. Um, don't see anything else. Oh. This place was falling apart long before the fire. Yeah, that's it. Got all the cowwebs. What do you know about Charles Hawkins' activities? Well, not much, to be honest. We all assumed the Hawkins lived on Charles's inheritance. Yeah, I don't think so. A book on the first inhabitants of the island. It seems they got here around the 14th century. Is that the medicine thing? Yeah, it is. Nice. I wish it gave more than 2%. <laughs> Ooh, man, this some of the spaces are really nice. I wouldn't want them in my house because they are very creepy, but they are very nice nonetheless. Oh man, so many things Dark to look at. Water history. This place was settled back in 1692 by two families that seceded from the New England colonies. A book on hunting whales, the island's staple diet last century. Oh, what is this? That looks like a shrine of a sort. There's something disturbing about this painting. Okay, I think that means we failed that ding. There's something disturbing. Yeah, about pretty sure that means we failed the, the investigation. So it gives you audio clues if you succeed or fail. thousand leagues under the sea. Another story about the mysteries of the deep. Now, this was a great book. I think all of uh, Jules Verne's books were great. They have made some great movies about them too, but uh, that guy was so, so far ahead at his time. Described a lot of modern inventions. I always wondered... Uh, if a lot of the things we invent isn't driven by what we have another crew bar. Imagined before. I think most of the times we first imagine something and then we make it real. We work to create it. Then create something and then um, see how it works. Look at that. I love the atmosphere. So far, the atmosphere is top notch. Uh, Greek mythology. Hecate, goddess of the dead, daughter of Tartarus, and mother of Scylla. Hecate is in Greek. The name of uh, Hecate, I guess. It's pretty close. What could Sarah have done to make this person threaten to call the police? The behavior of your wife? Huh. I wonder if uh, we're totally misreading the situation. It's the wife that's uh, 
Kind of crazy and uh, terrorizing the family and not the husband. God damn, there are so many ru What the fuck? Did I see a skull there or am I going crazy? I shouldn't play this game at uh, 12 a.m. Midnight. Where the fuck is the cop too? He just stayed back there. Let me go get him. Because I'm creeped out being alone. <laughs> if we can actually get him. Probably not. If you're right, we should be able to find clues among the Hawkins' personal effects. What do you know about Charles Hall? Nah, we get the same thing. So you want to follow us then? Kinda weird. Hmm. Locked. Kick it in. Yeah, we're going for scary things. This is the son's room. The boy's room. Damn. All right. The construction time. Love the fort. Pretty cool. Child's fort. From what threat was Simon protecting his world? I would have said the father, but now I'm not so sure. Yeah, there is definitely something there. Tom Sawyer, Mark Twain. Sarah must have read it to him before bed. I think we failed that investigation too. They got the tongue. Sleeping pills. Strong for an eleven year old boy. Maybe, maybe what not. I'm not sure. wrong with this family? What was wrong with this family? What nightmarish vision could have inspired them? Maybe whatever she had, uh, she passed to the child. Problems. That kid saw something. Something terrified him. Mm. All right. Okay. Locked. I thought for a moment it was open. Where the fuck is the other guy? Oh, something hidden. What will her room reveal about her? And what does the flame reveal? Hmm. Oh, nice. That got us uh, occultism. Is that the f I think that's the first occultism we find. That was all... Uh, yeah. Oh, there's something else. A key. Opens the door to Sarah Hawking's office. Nice. Barbiturates. Sarah Hawkins must have been extremely agitated resorting to such a treatment. I mean, seriously, if you, if you lived in a place like this, why wouldn't you have nightmares and visions? 
What the fuck is that noise? That was the cap coming up, but it's not. We have the key, dude. Perfect. <laughs> okay. We don't use the key, we actually pick the locks. I guess we have the key to the other door, not this one. Although they both should lead to the same place. Yeah, that's really strange. Ah. See some ritual implements. Summoning circles. Despite what happened, they seem to have loved each other. I mean, that could also be a threat. <laughs> was Sarah Hawkins interested in yeah. the cult? What was she we failed. To <laughs> Summon something? Protection from something? Usually the circles are for those reasons. Sarah Hawkins' agent was getting worried. Seems she wasn't giving any signs of life. Hmm. I wonder if she was making the money in the family. The fuck? Those are some weird... Ah, uh, statues. This ledger lists all of the paintings Sarah Hawkins sold. Wow, that's a lot of money. I mean, at that uh, age, 1924, whatever it was, that's a lot of money. Returned. Huh. I wonder why AD 1680 Damn Treatment What? It seems the last one was given for free to a Francis Sanders I wonder why That letter was very interesting I think that's all. Yep. Bradley? Is that you? What the fuck is Bradley? Is anyone there? The fuck? You stop. That's the thief. What is that uh icon there? I don't know. Bradley, did you see which way he went? Who? I didn't see anyone. I just heard some noise. Dude, you are so helpful. A man was hiding on the upper level. He ran when he saw me. He can't be far. Ah, uh, what is that icon? Again.
Oh, it's running out, whatever it is. I'll cover you. Oh, it might be the lamp oil. That would make this sense. Door was closed earlier. What door? Oh, that door over there. Where did he go? Must have got out some way. No, no, he was here. I'm sure. Let's oh, yeah, that opens. Oh, interesting. It looks like an old seaway map. The Skilla, the Prodigal, the Orpheus, the Saint... something. Have you seen the old maritime maps on Charles Hawkins' desk? Clearly, Charles Hawkins knew Captain Fitzroy very well. I wonder who the man with the glasses is in the photograph. Probably another friend of Hawkins. The Scylla. It's the boat that was stranded at the... This panel is movable. Uh-huh. Cogwheels. They must be linked to an opening map. Yeah, it's the bookies. Probably a secret passage. I must find a way to activate the opening map. With this, I should be able to force This way we got the crowbar. As if the bookcase has been moved well several done, times. Please. Charles Hawkins was a sort of traveler, right? More like Oh wait, did I miss uh, something? He left for months. Seems like this came from a log. Something is hitting the whales. Hmm. Must be a link with the seaway map. I see you. This Dr. Fuller, was he Sarah Hawkins' therapist? What the fuck? Still don't know what the hell is going on. They look like Celtic runes. Charles must have brought them back from one of his foreign trips. We're still missing stuff. That wasn't it. Okay, it's in here, whatever it is. Looks like the navigational path. Nope. We'll know about that. Log. Looks like the navigational path. I want that one, brother. In the log. Oh, that's the oil. Okay. I don't see anything else. It says I'm missing something, but I don't know what it is. The bookcase has been moved several times. The Scylla. It's the boat. It looks like a freehand map of dark water. Certain areas have been highlighted. I wonder why. Nope, that's not it either. The hell am I missing? Really? 
you won't let me go back? Just wonder. I guess I, I wanted to see if that was what I uh, was missing uh, to get the tick, but no. Nope. And Under it's closed now. So whatever it goes, I lost it. All right, that's fine. This is a good place to end the stream anyway. Thanks for dropping by. If you guys on YouTube, you know what to do. I'll try to be back tomorrow night with some more. And hopefully the weekend I can uh, have uh, some uh, decent enough time so I can play some Red Dead Redemption again. For now though, have a good night or day, depending where you are. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.